What's up YouTube, how's it going? It is your boy Breaks here. Today, today I've got for you all a brand new Mortal Kombat 11 video. And today's video we will be doing a combo tutorial, obviously, if you guys haven't already figured it out. And the character we will be using is Baraka. Also, if you have figured it out, I, I tend to hover over the character I'm going to be using. It, it's also in the title. Come on, guys. You already know. And my thing just went off. I'm guessing that's showing on the screen. I just got a subscriber. Oops. Sorry. And thank you at the same time. Anyway, so we are going to be doing a Baraka combo guide. Now, first things first, before we begin the video, I want to tell you all that I will be using the tournament Baraka. variations. So the variations that I use for all my characters and all my combo guides are going to be the tournament variations because those are set in stone. You can, when you're going online, you can set it to tournament mode. When you're fighting with your friends, you can set it to tournament mode. So that way this is a custom variation that everyone has, no matter who you are, where you are, who you're playing against. It makes it a little bit easier to play instead of having a million different variations with different moves that can all combine together to make it really complicated. This keeps it really simple and we can get some really big damage with Baraka as you guys are going to see in a minute. So I'll be using the tournament variation and I will also be using the first variation. So his very first setup, Hell's Teeth is what it's called. So before we fully break down this character, before we learn some of his disgustingly high damage combos, what I want to do first is explain to you guys that if you've seen any of my video, you already know this part, so you can skip straight to the tutorial. But if you're new here, this is to help you understand the combos even better and for you to get to become the best player you possibly can. I'm going to make this process as easy as possible for you. So I understand not everyone is on PlayStation 4 like I am. I am on PlayStation 4. You might be on, you might be on Xbox One. You might be on the Switch. You might be on the PC if this game's out for PC. I'm not sure. I, people have told me it is. I don't know. I don't play Mortal Kombat on the PC. But you might be on a multitude of different consoles. And so your buttons are going to be different than my buttons. So what I'm going to do to make that easier for you is I'm going to put a picture of a controller on the screen now. And then what I'm also going to do is I'm going to put numbers on that controller that correlate with positions of buttons on the controller. So instead of me saying square, because square doesn't exist if you're on Xbox, and if you're on the Switch, Square also doesn't exist. I'm going to be saying 1 to make this process easier because the buttons are all in the same circular pattern. No matter what console you're playing on, all controllers have the same circular pattern. The only thing that changes is the symbols of the buttons. So to make it so that everyone understands no matter what console they're on, I'm going to have numbers there instead of symbols. Because the numbers are universal, you just press the number when I say the number. The next thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be putting the full combo list on the screen for you guys and gals out there to go ahead and learn the, the entire combo before we even do it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So that is the first combo that we are going to be working on. It's going to begin with Mangled, going to go into Gutted. We're going to amplify it. We're going to do Hangry Jab, which is a jump forward jab. Then we're going to do Knee Lunge. And we're going to end the combo with Gutted again. Unfortunately, I can't put the same move on the screen twice, or I would. So the combo is going to end with Gutted. Just keep that in mind. But we're going to break it down step by step for you guys. And before I show you what this full combo looks like, what I want you to know is that Baraka is unique in that all of his combos can begin differently and the rest will be exactly the same. So how you begin the combo is really up to you. You can choose to begin it with 1-1-2. One, one, you can choose to begin it with a back 3-1. Or you can choose to begin it with forward 4. So the very first input you do is really up to you and is really situational. That's the beauty of Baraka. So let's say you get a punish and you're in a jab range, you can just do 1-1-2 one, one, and you'll get the same exact combo as if you were to do forward 4 and then cancel it into gutted. Or if you were to do back 3-1 and cancel it into gutted. So, oh my goodness, can it come out? Back 3-1, there we go. Or if you do back 3-1 and cancel it into gutted. So that is the beauty of Baraka in that his combos will be changed. The beginning will change according to your situation and you can adjust it however you want. But the rest of the combo will basically remain the same. And that is what I really, really like about Baraka. He's essentially the same combo, but with a different opener for every different situation you're in. And you can change the percentage of the combo and you can even change the combo up in the corner. I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like later. But for now, let's go ahead and break this combo down step by step. First things first, let me show you what the full combo looks like.
So that is the full combo. 35 damage for one bar. And you could have even turned that into a crushing blow because your gutted turns into a crushing blow after nine hits. So you can go ahead and hold the uh, hold the gutted after nine hits and it will turn completely into a crushing blow. Really, really powerful. So you can get even more damage on that combo if you want. So first things first, let's go ahead and break this combo down step by step for you guys. So like I said, this combo can begin multiple different ways. It can begin like four or three different ways. So you can choose to begin it with a low if you want with your back three one. You can choose to begin it with a spacing move with your forward four. Or you can choose to begin it the way I chose to begin it with one one three. Uh, I mean one one two, sorry. One one two. So it's really, really up to you. So let's go ahead and break it down step by step. So so we're gonna begin with one one two and then we're gonna cancel one one two into gutted, which is back forward four. So you're gonna do one one two, back forward four. And then you're gonna meter burn that back forward four or amplify it as it's called in this game. So that way Baraka can essentially throw him up in the air. Now when Baraka throws him up in the air, you're going to want to jump forward towards uh, Sub-Zero and hit him with a 1. So that way you keep the juggle going. And then right as you touch the floor, you're going to do a forward 4. So we're going to do that. We're going to do 1-1-2 one, one, into gutted, meter burn, jumping forward 1, and then forward 4. So as you saw, the forward 4 connected. So you're gonna the part in this combo that you're going to want to practice over and over again is going to be the jumping forward with the hangry jab to catch him in the air and keep the juggle going. That part is a little tricky. You have to get the timing right for that. But after you get that, the rest will be a breeze for you guys. So after you get that part down and you do the uh, the knee lunge, which is forward four, you're gonna cancel your forward four into another gutted, which is back forward four. So you're gonna do forward four, back forward four. And that is it. That is the full combo. Really, really simple. Baraka has some really simple combos for you guys. And I showed you three different ways to begin this combo without have to actually breaking it down three different ways because all you're changing is the beginning so let's say instead of doing one one two into gutted let's say i just do a back three one into gutted the rest stays the same i need to burn it i jump forward one like i said the jump forward one is going to be the tricky part for you guys there to grab that jump forward one you're going to get the hang of that and then you do the forward knee into the hangry grab and you can turn it into a crushing blow if you want by holding circle, or you can not turn it into a crushing blow. And the damage is tremendous. As you saw, that did, it said 36, but then because it's a crushing blow, it ticks for more. So it probably did like 40%. It, it looks like it did almost 45%, but it probably did around 40%. Absolutely insane, you guys. So how you begin it is really up to you. It's really up to the situation that you're in. Let's say you know your opponent's not guarding low and you want to open them up. You can just do the same as that combo I just showed you, but you just change the, the starter. So let's go ahead and break that down step by step one more time. So this combo is going to begin with 1-1-2. One, one, After your 1-1-2, one, one, you're going to cancel that into gut it, which is back forward four. And then you're going to amplify that. You're going to want to jump in the air after Sub-Zero is beginning to fall a little bit. I believe that's the timing. It's a little tricky. I haven't fully memorize it either but you're gonna yeah right as he's beginning to fall a little bit you're gonna jump forward in the air and catch him with a one and then you're gonna pre-input the knee lunge so you just pre-input it and then you're gonna cancel your knee lunge into a back forward four and that is the full combo you guys so you're gonna do knee lunge back forward four i'm gonna break that down one more time for you guys but it's really really simple so it's one one two gut it you amplify it jump forward towards him and then knee lunge into a gutted again really 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 simple you guys will do this i believe holy jeez look at the damage why does this health keep ticking oh my goodness baraka you savage so that was with one crushing blow i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and put in uh two crushing blows for this the same as that combo and we're gonna that'll be our second combo So I put the second combo on the screen for you guys. However, like I said, I couldn't get every single input in because if there's more than one input in the combo, you can't input it. You can't put it on the screen for you guys like that. So the combo is going to begin with Outworld Bash, the crushing blow. Then we're gonna go into Hangry Jab. We're gonna do Knee Lunge, Gutted, and then we're gonna uh, walk forward a little bit and do Knee Lunge again. And then we're gonna end it with Chop Chop, Chop Chop, Baraka, Chop Chop. So I'm going to show you guys what that combo looks like now before we go ahead and break it down step by step. So 
So there we have it, 40%, 407, which is basically almost like 41% for only one bar. Now, if you wanted to turn that into a double crushing blow combo, let's say you haven't used your gutted uh, yet, your crushing blow gutted, instead of doing chop chop, you could just do the gutted and hold it for the crushing blow. So you can get even more damage on that for double crushing blow if, if you want to. It's really up to you. As you guys, I've showed you earlier, you can just change it up in the end and instead of doing the chop chop, you just do gutted. Ah, the grab and then you turn it into a crushing blow and you get two crushing blows in one combo and i believe the damage hits something like 50 percent it, it gets insane so baraka could do really really high damage so in order for outworld bash to turn into a crushing blow it has to be on a punish so this is a combo you'll be using against the opponent after you guard something that you know is negative and you can get a really big combo off just by using this combo so let's go ahead and break it down step by step for you guys so it's going to begin with outworld bash which is one two two and in order to turn it into a crushing blow, like I said, it's a punish. I have it set up in my menu, so if I want a crushing blow, I have to hold down the last hit of the crushing blow. If you have it set to auto crushing blow, then it'll auto turn into crushing blow if it's a, if it's a punish, but I have it set to hold down for the crushing blow. So let's go ahead and do that first. So as you see here, it turns into a crushing blow. And then after the crushing blow, you're going to want to catch him in the air with Hangry Jab. You just jump up right after and press 1. And then you're going to pre-input the Knee Lunge, which I already discussed before. When you jump up in the air and press 1, you can then go straight into a forward 4, which is your Knee Lunge. Forward 4. And then you're going to cancel that Knee Lunge into a Gutted. So you're going to cancel your forward 4 into a back forward 4. So that's the part that will probably require the most practice in this combo. Once you can get that part down, the rest of it will be a cakewalk for you. So let's go ahead and do that. First, we gotta get him to attack us. Turn into a crushing blow. Then we're gonna do jump forward one, forward four, and gut it. Then you're gonna amplify it and step forward. So if you don't step forward, you'll completely whiff the second uh, knee lunge, and you won't be able to fully extend your combo. So you're gonna step forward just a little bit, just a, just a quick little step forward, and then you're gonna do forward four. So I'm gonna show you guys that part really, really quickly, so that way you can see that. So as you saw there with my Baraka, I stepped forward just a little bit before I did my knee lunge because I need to get closer to the sub-zero in order to extend the combo. So you step forward a little bit and then you do your, your knee lunge, which is forward four. And then after the forward four, you just cancel it into chop, 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 which is uh, down back three. So you just cancel your forward four into chop, chop, which is down back three. And then you just keep mashing that X to extend the chop chop. As you see here, you can extend it for so much longer if you just mash that X button out. It's really kind of crazy, which gets you the, mo the max damage you possibly can off of the chop chop. So I'm gonna show you what that full combo looks like one more time so that way you guys can get a grasp of it. So it's gonna begin with one, two, two, as the crushing blow version. So it's gotta be on block, one, two, two. We're gonna jump forward one, forward four into a gutted meter burn it walk forward forward four oh, i did gutted again you could choose to end it with a second gutted or you could choose to end it with a chop chop as you saw there the second gutted is going to decrease the damage at, by a little bit and the chop chop will increase the damage by a little bit so it's really really up to you i i went with the chop chop because like i said it has more damage so i'm going to show you the chop chop one one more time Oh, there you go. You can see it. 47, four, 407, which is, I think, 41% or 7. You round up to 1, which makes it 41, maybe. So very, very close to 41% for only one bar. So it's a really, really strong punishing combo to have in your toolkit if you are Baraka. Highly recommend you guys learn this combo. Well, let's go ahead and get into the third combo. So the third combo I will be showing you is a corner specific combo. Now, as we've already discussed in the first combo, you can choose to begin your combos with Baraka a multiple tubes of different ways. So you can either do the one, one, two that I will be showing you, or you could do the uh, back three, one, or you could even do forward four. The combo is really up to your discretion how you choose to begin it. 
but the rest of the combo will remain the same. It has, I guess, a little bit less leeway, unless you know more damage than I do, but this is a, a very high damaging combo for Baraka. So it's one of the great, it, one of his greatest toolkits you could have for Baraka in the corner. So I highly recommend you guys learn this combo. Now, once again, uh, I, this combo is gonna have Mangled in it twice, but I can't put Mangled on the screen twice. So we're gonna break it down step by step for you guys so that way you can see when you press Mangled the second time around. So first things first, I'm gonna show you what the full combo looks like, and then we're gonna break it down step by step for you guys. So as you saw there, 42% for one bar in the corner. Very, very, very high damage with Baraka. This guy is a combo monster, if you ask me. His damage is insane. 42% for one bar in the corner. So let's go ahead and break that down step by step for you guys. So the combo is going to begin with 1-1-2. One, one, and then after your 1-1-2, one, one, you're going to cancel it into Mangled, which is uh, back forward. I mean gutted, sorry, not Mangled. Mangled is the beginning. You're going to cancel it into gutted, which is back forward 4. So you do 1-1-2, one, one, back forward 4. And then you're going to amplify it, so that way you get him to flip in the air. And when you amplify it to get him to flip in the air, you wait a little bit, and then you're going to do your standing four to keep him juggled just a little bit longer. And then after your standing four is when you're going to go into the second mangled, which is 1-1-2 one, one, again. So let's go ahead and break that down. 1-1-2, one, one, gut it. Or let me give you an example of that. So it's 1-1-2, one, one, back four, four, amplify it, standing four, 1-1-2. One, one, I dropped it that time because it's hard to talk and do the combos at the exact same time, but you guys, I'm going to show you guys real quick without talking. So there you go, you guys saw. So after you do your gutted, you're going to do a standing four into a 1-1-2 one, one, again. And after your 1-1-2, one, one, you can just end it with chop chop, which is down back three, and then you mash that X button to fully cap out the damage there. And that is the full corner combo with Baraka. Really, really easy. That was what, three steps? We broke the full combo down into just three steps. And if you guys did the first two combos, then you could definitely do this. So let's go ahead and show you guys one more time. So it's one, one, two, and then back forward four. Then you're gonna amplify it. Standing four, one, one, two again, and then down back three, and you just mash that three button out. 42% you guys, one bar, corner combo with Baraka. Instead of doing the chop chop if you want, like I said, you can end the combo in the gutted and go for a crushing blow. Let's go ahead and see how much damage that combo would do. So that does 43% and then as you can see here, it continues to tick to like below 50 percent i mean above 50 percent if not exactly 50 i think that's above 50 percent so it takes above 50 percent if you choose to get your crushing blow there so basically with that it's the same as that combo you just instead of ending it with the chop chop you're just gonna go ahead and end it with a gutted crushing blow so that way you can get the same as that combo but for 50 percent or more damage it was it looked a little bit more than 50 percent so be sure to practice these combos over and over again until you can get them right because you are going to get some massive damage with Baraka. So like I said, all of the combos can begin differently. So you can choose to do the same exact combo, but with a different opener to, depending on your situation. You know? So the combo remains exactly the same, just the opening move you choose to use is what changes. So that's the beauty of Baraka. So feel free to go into practice mode and practice these combos over and over again so that way you can crush your opponent as well as your friends online. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. Let me know in the comment section below what character you are interested in learning most next. And I will see you all in the next one.